In this experiment, what I'm going to be looking for is a slight change in motion of the horizontal torsion pendulum you see there. I've used this one before in a different video. Just a quick overview of the setup there. So on the left, you'll see the big spool of fiber optic cable, glass single mode fiber. And behind it is the balance consisting of uh, two ceramic tile plates, each about four kilograms on each side. The whole thing is suspended on two strands of fishing line in the middle, which is hung on that two by four right in the middle there. And then there's an aluminum foil sheet to shield one side from the other uh, from any kind of light. There's also a plastic sheet there in front just to stop any air movement that might interfere. Here's a close-up of the spool and about how close the ceramic tiles are to it. A top view of the apparatus. Now here is a red laser line that's attached to the center and the very bottom of the torsion pendulum. And this is just looking at the oscillation period of the whole thing in time lapse. So it swings from about 55 to 50 centimeters. So the green light is another laser pointer I use to tell myself when I'm turning the laser on. And so when it's on, it means the red laser that I used before is going through the coil, which you can't see in the video. So just to be clear, there's three lasers in total in this experiment. One is the one you see on the screen, which is just an indicator. The other is the laser that I'm shooting into the fiber optic coil and then the other green laser is just a visual indicator to tell me when I look at this video later on when I'm actually turning on the laser. So the purpose of this whole experiment was just to explore something like uh, a modified Cavendish experiment and to see if uh, the light photons going around and around and around in the coil might have some influence on the gravito inertial field of the ceramic plates. So because there's no detectable radial forces here, I might conclude that having a bunch of windings like that doesn't make the effect stronger. However, there could be still a tangential component, which I still need to check for based on an observation I made, but need to work with that a bit more. Thanks for watching.